going to be played in August style, or are we going to see it end up being more of a uh, early game carry that can come out and do damage? Well, when we saw in the regular season, Eagles, and now it's going to be Searing Chains. Little RNG love that time. DK Phobos gets off the waning rip. Don't think it's going to matter. And first blood drawn by Mushi as he went for the Searing Chains. Exactly the same amount of net worth. And Puck did just pick up his blink, so I guess that's one glimmer of hope here for VP Polar. Speaking of Puck, he might get initiated on here actually by the Batrider. Got Hangs him. it out. Easy peasy kill. Just picked up his blink. Not going to be able to use it here. Yeah, he did get off the coil. He's going to end up dead regardless. Illidan does come in and get a kill. However, the damage output is tremendous. Static Storm caught no one. Bye Kinetic bye Field whipped. Bye bye, Mag. Bye bye. The, uh, the Kinetic Field just whipped. There's a lift on the Demon. FNG's next on the list. He did a nice two man impale. Best of the game. But he does get a, a nice kill onto the Terror Blade. But too little too late comes to mind. Illidan is back in the base healing up, does have a Yasha. Roshan is going to die so fast too. And the great thing is, is he can just take damage. He's going to use it to maybe tank. Oh no, they triggered the stomp, which kind of sucks. Here we go. Possible fight. Do they have a sentry down? I don't think they There, do there we go. They got him. CYS going to end up oh dropping. Oh my god. Yeah, that's a big misplay. There's going to be a glimpse bringing back DDC. He's going to end up dead. Got off the... Ice Blast, I don't know that's going to matter, and Ohio allowed his fire fearing chains, caught a couple, and Ohio might be able to steal this, nope, tried to go for it, Illidan does manage to grab it, and that's going to be another down, they're going to end up getting Mag as well, beautiful double kill from Mushi with the searing chains that time health maybe a little bit more yeah and then they just jumped in and said oh okay you're almost dead kaboom and blew him up and he wasn't even a part of that fight yeah i think it's just simply they needed someone standing outside the pit they should have known that the nyx is going to walk in with a vendetta Speaking lift nyx lift on the phobos done and here we go on the other side zyf in trouble again and this is a good kinetic field static storm this time mantis and hello <laughs> and that one hurts a bit fng Punished. You have to drop him during the duration of the silence. Otherwise, in favor of LV. But that window of opportunity LV had where they could have potentially closed the game out has closed. Illidan is now a force to be reckoned with. Yeah, and here comes the smoke, actually. They're pinging they it out it. like crazy. Oh, he walks up a carapace is right into the Firefly Trail. They're going to get FNG from behind with CYF, though. Behind that, there's going to be a reinitiation. They are going to be able to bring down Puck. And just kind of a mess of an initiation that time. Didn't seem like they had a game plan going in, and they lose two because of it. And here comes Anti Mage jumping onto the store, uh, jumping onto Illidan, or sorry. No mana. CYF in trouble, tries to get away, but his boy's right there, and they're going to get the Aegis. In flame has coil. And is he gonna spend it? Uh oh, a little bit of lag. Yeah, I guess he did. So <laughs> Illidan now locked down. So unfortunate time to see lag there, but the coil did help hold him in place and did help them clean him up for the second time. And they get demon from behind. There's the glimpse, but it's not gonna matter. Did him a favor, basically. 20 to 8. And Illidan. Who had just gotten himself racks down, Illidan up, and they can't fight. I don't think they should pursue this. This could blow up in their face. There's actually going to be a coil behind it. They are going to get uh, one with it. Ohio, though, is ready. Doesn't have a lasso, though. Behind that, Illidan locked down for the moment. There's an Omni Slash with that scepter. Doesn't accomplish a lot. In fact, oh, he caught the Omni Slash. Oh, he's. <laughs> and the damage output coming out of ZYF is just too tremendous. Phobos tracked down, and FNG, do they have any detection? Illidan's going to come, and he did manage to get the Terra Blade on the back of a big mana void. Ends up being a two for two. Glimpse back into the... Face it back. He got the lift off. There's going to be DK Phobos coming back in, but CYF just continuing to peck away. Mag's going to take a spill. Phobos is next. Demon standing all on his own. The coil did go off, but to no... And they're sending the remnant up. Courier, he may snipe the courier here. <laughs> Yep, he's trying to anyway. The sort of lasso managed to get Illidan of all targets. He's drugged down to the low ground. They're going to try to engage, but here comes FNG trying to make something happen behind that. We see the battle raging up as an Omni Slash from Mag doesn't accomplish anything. He just dies for free. FNG right on top of Inflame. Inflame actually stole Vendetta. Now Ohio and FNG going back and forth. Up at the top, we've got Illidan who managed to track down the Terror Blade and now on the tail of Mushi. And there's going to be the remnant back and away. Only Illidan remains standing, but he did get the big target, ZYF. Illidan, a man attack. amongst 
enemies. And a little optimistic, one versus five, not quite, as he's down. And Polar will secure an easy Roshan off of that. One that led this game was at about two minutes in. <laughs> Yeah, it didn't go too well in the laning station. And we, you know, we talked about that. It probably, I'll we'll have to hold that thought, is this could be the final push of the game, actually. ZYF oh. pops the Manta. Takes a lot of damage, actually, from FNG, but, but there's the ulti. Ohio there. The Phobos goes in. Got off his abilities, but BKBs are plenty on everyone. And all they have to do is pick their target. Mag's down, Phobos is down. <laughs> Yeah, his damage output is no joke. And poor Demon's gonna burn to death. Behind that, Illidan's trying to man up and has to blink away. He got hit with the Ice Blast and the Scotty was slowing him down. And they actually got him in Searing Chains. It's a double damage that was bottled up beforehand, by the way, for Mushi. Not even fair. It's like having cheat codes. <laughs> yep. And with the AA ulti constantly on him as well. Good game. Yeah, very, very well played. Dominance from start to finish here from LV Gaming, showing that they can still look this good even without the like the Lycan, so very nicely drafted, even better played specifically by Mushi and ZYF. And of course, as I mentioned, DDC, I mean, I mean, the entire cast, DDC, I think only one death the entire game on the Ancient Apparition. Uh, I'll have to double check on that. Just everyone did their job. Yep, 2, 1, and 21 for the Ancient Apparition. That's and the amount player. of farm, the amount of farm this terribly got, what, like a 12-minute